right. We've been looking at the five foundation stones of, of our Reformation faith. Uh, and the word is alone. We've looked at scripture alone. It is the ultimate authority that we have. No other authority uh, gives us uh, eternal truth. It is the Bible alone. Uh, and it comes to us by grace alone. We didn't think it up. We didn't figure it out. We didn't earn it. God brings it. Grace alone uh, through faith. It is not what we do, it is what we believe. It is that belief that holds on to the branch when we're falling off a cliff. It is our faith. It's not the strength of our faith, but the person in whom we have our faith. And today we're looking at in Christ alone, that one that we hold on to. It is Christ alone. He's not one way to God. He's the only way to God. And next week we'll finish this with the uh, uh, sola deo gloria. Uh, to God alone be glory. It is all for the glory of God. So that's where we're going. This is the fourth of our five sermons. And I chose to uh, look at Colossians 1, verses 15 to 23 for our text this morning. Hear the word of God. He is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creation, for by him all things were created in heaven and on earth, visible and invisible. Whether thrones or dominions or rulers or authorities, all things were created through him and, and for him. And he is before all things, and in him all things hold together. And he is the head of the body, the church. He's the beginning, the firstborn from the dead, that in everything he might be preeminent. For in him all the fullness of God was pleased to dwell, and through him to reconcile to himself all things, whether on earth or in heaven. 